Hello everyone, Fanta here, you're watching Fantavision, and today, <sighs> Nintendo is doing more stupid things. I don't, it's like the week of stupid, and I say that because even though I made that PlayStation video about a week ago, I mean, this, it happened within the same week, pretty much. It happened within a week of each other, of the whole cross-platform crap, and... Nintendo now saying that there are certain games that won't support cloud saves, which was the only benefit, in my opinion, to having Nintendo online. I don't... And their reasoning behind it is the stupidest thing in the world. Because the reason they say that some games you can't have cloud support for, mind you... Every other console, including the PC on Steam, has cloud support for every game. And there's no, like, oh, well, only these games can do it. There's no exclusivity to the games. This is what they have to say. They, they say that it's because of cheating. Now, if, if cheating can really be done that easily just through saves, you have a fundamental problem with your game. You have a fundamental problem with everything that you have right now. I mean, that's... What? Saving? Your save can help you cheat in an online game? If that's that's how you're doing it, you need another way to protect from cheaters. I remember people have already been cheating on Splatoon. People... Some guy kept making accounts to the point where... Um, I think he, like, hacked it so that he was all the top spots. And it said, like, Nintendo needs an anti-cheat system or something like that and I don't know how there hasn't been up until this point an anti-cheat system people are shitty that's just a fact of life so when you don't have an anti-cheat system in a game people are going to take advantage of that and if it's really that easy they only have to manipulate the saves first of all why is Splatoon 2's multiplayer data on your system at all as far as I know, most online games, all of it is on the back end of the game server. You don't have any of that on your system. And the reason I'm really upset about this is because Splatoon 2 needs cloud saves. It just needs it. What am I going to do if I get a new system? What am I going to do if my system dies? You're fucked, which is exactly what happened with my Wii U. I had a portable hard drive because the hard drive that was in the Wii U was pathetic. It was like a 32 gigabyte or something like that. It's not an iPod. It's a system and it had a 32 gigabyte hard drive. Anyway, so I had my external hard drive fail. And then all of a sudden I lost all of my game saves for everything. And I was like, you know, at least Splatoon's an online game. My account is probably linked to their server. As soon as I start my game again, I can just be like back to whatever level I was. I think it was near max level. And then I turn on my game and I'm back to level one. I've lost everything. And that was why I was so excited for cloud saves to come to the Nintendo Switch. Because the Nintendo Switch is the only console you can really lose. Because it is a portable system. So with cloud saves, yeah, it's going to suck if you lose your system. But at least you have all of those saves backed up to your account. But now, fuck you if you want to save. Like, I don't... Fuck you if you lose it, you know? I, I don't get it. I don't get the logic here. Because this is such an important aspect of video games these days. It's a, an important essential feature that you need with the failure rate of systems with going to friends houses with moving with all these different incremental upgrades they have for systems if i had to move all of my saves from my old xbox one to my xbox one s that would have been such a pain in the ass can you imagine if you accidentally wiped one of your systems and you just lost everything forever it's not the 2000s anymore you know it's not the early 2000s we don't have memory cards anymore there should be no reason you ever lose your game saves anywhere this is just ridiculous i i don't understand their reasoning 
I don't... I don't know. I don't know what to say. I'm just kind of baffled that Nintendo is doing this. Another stupid thing that they're doing from a company that makes some of the best games. That has made a very creative... I love the Nintendo Switch. I love the system. It's great. It's a little underpowered, but you know what? The way that Nintendo designs their games for their systems, they always look phenomenal and they run perfectly. I mean, even like Skyrim and other things like that run perfectly on the Switch. But <laughs> they always make stupid decisions on like the hardware side. I don't know if this is a hardware side or it's just a software, just the system side is where they make so many stupid decisions because no cloud saves, no voice support, even though you can do that in Fortnite on your Switch. I don't get that. The friends list is pathetic. You have to use friend codes. They're just stuck in the past. And they're expecting to charge people $20 a year for this thing. And I get 20 bucks, not that much, right? But it's basically throwing away a $20 bill for no reason. You're, it's, it's throwing away money on something that is not giving you anything. And I know there's going to be people in the, the comments that disagree with me, but you're just wrong. I don't, I don't know what to say to you. I'm not going to argue with you. You're just wrong. Because Nintendo has had free online up until this point. The only reason they're jumping in and making you pay for it is because everybody else is doing it. That's the only reason. There's no other reason. If, if you're going to say, oh, but Fanta, I, they're going to they're gonna give you NES games. If they wanted to make that a thing, make that a separate service. Don't infringe on my online playability and my ability to play online with, like, all the people that I usually play with, you know? Don't, don't stop me from playing online just because you want to sell your stupid cloud game service or whatever it is, you know? Make that separate. Make that a separate thing. Instead, just give us the free online, and you'll have a much happier fan base. And update the friends list thing. Now I'm just asking for things they're not going to do. But the main reason I want to make this video is to just point out how ridiculous and stupid this problem is. And it's I've seen a pretty decent sized list so far. I don't know if it's going to be every game that has an online multiplayer feature to it, but I don't know. The fact that there's any game on this exclusion list, in my opinion, is not acceptable. Because this is the only system that has an exclusion list for cloud saves. Which really, cloud saves should have been on the system to begin with. I get that Sony charges for cloud saves. I don't know if Xbox does, but I feel like that just should, should just be a free part of the system. Because it's such an important thing for gaming. I mean, how many... How many hours do you dump into a game? You lose all of that if it gets deleted, and that's just ridiculous. That shouldn't be a fear that people have to worry about. And now instead, we're all going to have to worry, what happens to my Switch? What happens if it just dies? What if it gets erased for some reason? The memory gets corrupted. You're fucked. That's it. That's all there is to it. Nintendo doesn't care. And even though there shouldn't be, you shouldn't be able to cheat through saving anyway... That's never going to get fixed. That's the sad thing about a lot of these problems. You know the companies are not going to fix it. And I can't tell you why. I don't know if it's laziness. I don't know if the way they built the game and their save system, they're just not able to do that. But I refuse to believe that in a time where we constantly have huge updates to not only systems, but games as well. So, fix your shit. Thanks for watching, everyone. If you guys liked the video, definitely leave a like down below. Comment down below what you guys think about this new news. It's just so stupid, in my opinion. And I don't... Uh, I don't know. I'm just baffled. I'm, I'm, I shouldn't be at this point because it's Nintendo, but it just it's shocking how stupid this is. And as always, even though Nintendo makes a lot of stupid decisions, even though... To like one of the only places where you can play Nintendo games on. Have a fantastic day. See you guys. By the way, before my camera dies, if anybody's interested, I know some people are. I'm drinking Rockstar Energy Drink. It's the organic one. It's pretty good. I like it because you can read the ingredients list and you know what the things are. You know? 
And they also use cane sugar instead of uh, corn syrup. So that's cool, you know? Every, every little bit of difference helps me feel like I'm not killing myself with these kind of things. <laughs>